Hello my friends and watch lovers, I am Giuseppe, I am the author of the Microbrands book series Inside Microbrands and Independent Watchmakers. Today we will take a look at two different watches from two different independent brands, but with the use of the same material, I'm talking about carbon. About my wrist today, I am wearing a Baltic Hermetic with the Miota Movement 9039, automatic and less than 800 euro. So, check out the video. So in the last years, a lot of independent brands have decided to use different materials to create the case or the dial or the bezel or other different parts of the watch. Today, we take a look at Formex Leggera 41 mm and the Venezianico Carbon 42 mm. Uh, these watches have a price range from 1000 up to 2000 uh, for the Formex. And uh, I think it's a pretty interesting uh, take a look at uh, the use of the same material for two different brands. I hope that this video will help you better choose uh, if uh, put in your collection this kind of material. Starting from the Venezianico, as you can hear, the sounds of the bezel uh, are pretty good and uh, I have to say that uh, the bezel is probably one of the most important points of this watch. Uh, you can see the carbon uh, into the bezel uh, for the bezel insert uh, and also on the dial. Uh, the watch is made uh, of stainless steel with a PVD coating. I prefer the watch with the NATO strap to use during the summer or hot periods of the year, uh, while uh, um, there is the possibility also to have a stainless steel bracelet uh, or a rubber strap. For the Formex uh, you can see here carbon dial and also the case is fully made of uh, carbon fiber. Uh, this is the reason why this watch weighs uh, just 40 grams, so it feels very light on the wrist. And as you can see, the bezel, which is a part of the suspension system, is made of ceramic, like the crown. Uh, this watch uh, has an open case back. Uh, I have decided to use NATO strap for both of these two watches uh, so that you can see better the differences and uh, also how it wears uh, on my wrist. Now let's take a deep look into these watches and let's see all the details. As you can see here, all the little shades from the carbon dial of the Formex are pretty clear and you can see the differences between the case, the ceramic bezel, the dial and also the inner bezel of the watch. For the Venezianico you can see uh, different shades uh, and uh, also the color of the carbon tends more uh, to grey and uh, the shades are pretty clear on uh, the bezel. Talking about the loom, there is a difference between these two watches, uh, basically because of the dimensions of the indexes, which are bigger for the Venezianico and thin for the Formex. So let me know in the comment uh, if you like these watches, what you like or what you don't like. Uh, and uh, if you like my channel, remember to subscribe. Thank you and have a nice day.